Yo, how's it going ladies and gentlemen, it's DeltaFast07 here, and as you guys could tell, my voice sounds fucking different, it's because uh, one of my, you know, like one of my cool friends fucking let me borrow this shit, you know, he's fucking dope, a big huge shout out to him, his name is JVR, I, mean, I, like, I call him JVR because I want to keep his name anonymous for safety reasons, but big huge fucking shout out to him dude, like, like this mic sounds clear as fuck as you guys could tell, you know, compared to my crappy mic, but I mean... <laughs> Like that's besides the point. Let's let's get you know all this friendship out of the way and let's go to my top ten guys. So fucking uh, my you know like my number ten is Destiny. You know Destiny is the first PlayStation Four game I actually played. You know the fir you know like as soon as I got my hands on PlayStation Four, you know I decided to play Destiny. Put some time into it. I liked it. I mean, like like there's a lot of variety which I liked. You know there's a couple variety. You know like where you could pick. Where you could pick like three different three different types of characters, which is fucking dope. Like, you know, like in my opinion, you get to choose a hunter, warlock, and I think the other one was Titan, and they all have different abilities, which will help you in different you know uh, different occasions and different you know types of situations that you have in the game, which is uh you know I find that fucking dope. Anyways, guys, let's go to number nine. Number nine, I had to be Mortal Kombat X. Why Mortal Kombat X, dude? Because it's fucking Mortal Kombat. It's, it's, it's fucking Mortal Kombat, guys. You know, like you know that like that game that that basically had the fatalities where you you know the friendship and there's the fucking like 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 you like you all know that guy like they used to play Mortal Kombat with and you don't talk to him anymore because you fucking like beat the shit out of him like thirty times and like you know with Scorpion and using cheap moves and stuff like that. Yeah, that's basically me. Like like I remember I used to uh, play with my brother. Mortal Kombat X, like, sometimes I beat him, sometimes he beats me, because, you know, we both have, a, you know, like, a good amount of skill. But, but like, but like as soon as I hear the word finish, I'm like, I don't even, you know, I don't even think about it. I just go for the fucking vitality, and, like, just, like, how you rub it into their face, and, like, they have, like, that fucking face of defeat, dude. It's fucking amazing. Anyways, let, let's go to number eight, even though a lot of people are gonna hate me for this one. But, hey, guys, it's just my opinion. Don't get fucking triggered. I had to put GTA 5. You know, like, GTA 5, I, I like that game. You know, I find it pretty good. I, I play, you know, I play the whole cam, you know, the whole story mode. I play a little bit of multiplayer. I have it ranked up a lot because I don't play multiplayer that much on GTA 5. Because I'm going to get fucking destroyed. But, I mean, that's besides the point. GTA 5 had, you know, the good story. You know, like, classic GTA, you know, get the money, get the hoes, get the type of thing, you know, cars and stuff like that. Which I find dope, you know, because you want to live the good life in GTA 5. Anyway, let's go to number seven. Number seven, even though I think it was originally for PS3 and PS Vita, but they transferred it to the PS4, so technically it is a PS4 game. But I, uh, it's Sound Shapes. If you guys don't know what that game is, because I, I feel like a lot of people don't know, I think it's an indie game. It's still a game though. It's a, uh, it's a game where you basically make music notes. It's like a, it's like a platformer, like you know, like Mario stuff like that. Which allows it to turn like into a slime ball that that you stick into things, or like just a rolling ball that you get to run really fast. And it's like that, and you collect music notes, and those music notes like they basically like it's just music. And I fucking love music. If you guys didn't know, like music is basically it's dope and all like you know like different varieties and stuff like that, which I fucking love, and it still it still keeps on doing really well to this day, which I fucking you know I admire that shit. Anyways, let's go to six. All right, even even though this is already a you know originally a PS3 game, and they transferred it to PS4. It's a uh, Plants vs Zombies: Gone Warfare. I originally played the game for PS3. Yeah, da 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 Like you know, like blah blah blah. Like you played PS3, so. Yeah. But I mean, like I played it on PS3, and then they transferred it to PS4. So shut the fuck up, first of all. But I mean, like, I really enjoyed that game. Like, uh, I got my brother into it. We played that shit. You know, like, like we stayed up all night getting all the fucking characters, you know, wait, like, spending time getting, you know, grinding on those coins and try to get good things. Which we did. We ended up getting basically all the characters. I think we missed, like, one or two, but I mean, like, who cares about the one or two? <laughs> but we actually, you know, ended up getting... There's a lot of fucking variety in this third person as well, which I fucking love third person. And it includes, you know, like, the favorite PvZ characters, like, plants and zombies and stuff like that. 
Yeah, let's go. Let's switch it up to number five. All right, guys. <laughs> the sequel. Come on. Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2, which recently came out in last year. No, this year, February. Which, you know, I found it fucking dope and amazing. Like, like, like just the way how it looked. And, like, they brought even more new characters. They allowed you to transfer your old characters from Garden Warfare 2. Or Garden Warfare to Garden Warfare 2. So, you, you know, you don't have to spend all that time again to fucking grind for the same old characters that you got. Which I find that fucking amazing. You know, like, good job, EA. Good job, PopCap. You know, like, I got to top off my head to them. Because, damn, they, they must have taken a really long time and dedication to get that game down. And there's, you know, there's even more variety, even though I said that. There's even more variety. And there's more things to do, which I find that fucking amazing. <sighs> I, I can't believe I'm going to say this. For number four, people are going to get their fucking... They're just going to get triggered. <laughs> and number four is... Advanced fucking warfare. I mean... Dude, like, I put so much time into the game. Hate all you fucking want. I can't believe you guys can... I'm pretty sure you guys are going to get fucking triggered. Besides the supply drop system, besides the fucking exo jumping, I think the game would do, was, like, doing really fine on its own, in my opinion. It was, you know, like... I guess that was, like, the game, like, one of the games I actually put time into. You know, like, leveling up, prestiging, getting those new weapons. And stuff like that. But, I mean, hey, that's just my fucking opinion. And going into number three. Number three, you know, it's the game that I'm fucking playing right now. Which is Black Ops 3. Even though I didn't uh, get the campaign. Like, like, I played it, but I mean, like, I just don't understand it. I hope, like, some of you guys could actually explain it or send me a link where they actually explain it. Uh, I'll be happy to read it and understand it. The multiplayer, I find it fucking dope. Like, you know, new weapons, even though it's supply drop type of bullshit. I still like it. And stuff like that. Anyways, moving on to uh, fucking <laughs> number... What was it? Number two. Number two. Bringing it, bringing it down really quick is The Last of Us. Dude, The Fucking Last of Us. <clears throat> One of the best games that I ever played. Uh, honestly, I actually... Call me a crybaby or whatever, but I actually cried on the first... You know, like on the first 10 minutes of the game. If you guys don't know the first 10 minutes of The Last of Us, I'm pretty sure you guys need to check that out. It's going to be fucking dope. <laughs> just, just, I won't dive too much because I'll take too much of your time into it. Anyways, let's move on to number one. Number one, this holds a very, you know, this holds very dear to my heart. It's a uh, fucking, it's some Uncharted 4. Uncharted 4 is probably one of the best games I've ever fucking played throughout my whole life. Uh, you know, I don't want to dive too much details into it because I'm going to bother the fuck out of you guys. You know, anyways, guys, that's going to be my fucking, uh, anyways, that's going to be my top 10 PlayStation games. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe, why not? Your company is always appreciated. And this is Delta Fast 07, signing out.